What is up fan? Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another episode of Wheel Swap Wednesday. This is episode number seven. Can you believe it? Almost up in double digits here. Um, so episode six, we swapped out this old Nissan Skyline 2000 GTX with some wheels from the uh, Hot Wheels RLC. And today we have another Skyline Liberty Walk Edition. And these, as you can see, has super teeny wheels on it. And in that RLC kit came with these teeny little guys that are gonna be perfect for. And it's kind of cool because the um, kind of gold um, graphics there on the windshield match the wheels. So that will kind of bring out those colors. And I think these wheels being black with like the black, um, with a black little wide body kit, like the wheels kind of just blend in and I think it needs a little more color in there. So that is what we are going to do today. And I also upgraded, let me see if I can do this without spilling. I got all organized. So if you don't follow me on it, or if you follow me on Instagram, you already saw this. And if you don't follow me, then get over there and follow. So you can get some sneak peeks on some of this stuff. So I got organized with my wheel swap kit. Um, I got all the tools. I got all my wheels, all the tap drills, uh, flush cutters, and then axles, wheels for days. So it's nice being all being all organized with that. But we're gonna start out. Gonna drill out these rivets. So I'm gonna do a nice little pilot hole in each one of these existing holes, and then we'll step up to the next drill bit size and get those rivets out. Okay, so we got the small uh, pilot hole drilled, which is the same size drill bit that I used for the tap. So now I'm gonna step up the size a little bit and drill straight into that same hole. Okay. Now I'm gonna go up one more size here. And this one should just pop the rivet right out. So you can kind of see the rivets pretty well eaten away. We'll go in with this last one, one size bigger. And there it is. See, I can't get it off the, the drill bit here, but yeah, so you can see it popped, popped the drill or the rivet right out. Nice and clean, no rivet, no rivet. Falls right apart. Okay, let me uh, clean up my mess here real quick. It's always nice to have a little vacuum or something nearby to kind of clean up some of those shavings. So next we're gonna take our uh, flush cutters and cut off these little nibs to hold the wheels on. Let's see, is that enough to get it out? Nope. Now these wheels are so teeny. Okay. Stock wheels are out. Clean up this channel here a little bit. So we have some room to fit the new the new wheels in. I wonder if these are different size widths at all. Let's see. Sometimes they are. Yeah, those pretty much look the exact same. Let's just do a quick do a quick test fit. Very nice. So I don't know if that was there before or not. It's kind of a bummer. Let's look at the good side here. Yeah, it looks nice. 
So next step is to um, drill with the small drill bit and then tap the hole and screw it back together and then we're done. Okay, so back with my smaller bit here and we're going to just continue to drill on into these posts, get it in there away so our screw will go in and we can tap it and put our screws in. So we got both the uh, front and rear post uh, tapped and are ready for the screws now. But And we got the chassis down here. It's assembled and ready to go. So we'll throw the windshield in. Okay. Set the body back on top very carefully. And uh, so I think it kind of rubbed off a little bit, but I actually just put some black Sharpie over that but while I was uh, tapping it out it uh, kind of rubbed it off but you could not tell at all so that was that was pretty nice Chris is a uh, paint and body shop over here for Hot Wheels only tools I have in my arsenal is a black sharpie and here we have the finished product pretty happy with this and I finally got to use these teeny wheels that I thought I would maybe never use but yeah I think these last two episodes were pretty cool I think these cars uh, together this is a pretty cool look for some old school old school Nissan all right well I hope you guys enjoyed and uh, if you did enjoy it would be awesome to you know, get a subscription, maybe a like, maybe a comment, maybe an Instagram follow. Who knows? Maybe all of them. See how uh, see how generous you guys are feeling. But I appreciate all the support. And uh, yeah, check back next time for episode eight. Catch you later. Peace.